Welcome to Second Chance Garage. Okay, this is what I did tonight. Uh, I put in that shelf. Then I got my pizzazz up there. I got a toaster up there. I had the pizzazz sitting on top of the microwave. I had the toaster sitting on top of the microwave. I had this sitting on my counter. I had all this stuff sitting on my counter. So my counter space was getting limited. So I put the new shelf up there. I put four. Oh, I had my knives sitting on the counter here. So my counter space was getting limited. So I've got one, two, three. I put four of those plus a block here. And a block there and it's good and solid set an elephant on it and then hung my little sign on there then I was able to put stuff on top of the microwave and cleaned up my counter yep got some of my counter space back and then I had my cricket sitting down here and then so I put it up there on that shelf that I had installed for a little more storage space and then of course I've got I've got uh, that hook rail system up there for my coats my belt that kind of stuff yep and then, uh, of course, the bed, you know, that folds into a bench. I showed you that. When I built it, I put in storage over here. That's where my vacuum is. Um, that whip, I store all kinds of stuff on, the, on that stuff. Of course, I got storage in here. That storage back there. Behind the pillows, I got storage under the TV. There's a can't tell it, it's probably too dark, but anyway, there it's a door that opens up and it's pretty deep. I got storage under this bench, got storage under this bench, access there, access. On the outside, underneath that bench, storage there, storage there. Took the stove out, made that all storage, all that's countertop. And then, you know, I got my electric stuff to cook with, plus my gas stoves in there. Uh, oh, and I keep my electric skillet most of the time in there, too. Uh -huh. I'll show you. Mm -hmm. Open this up. Okay, I took out the stove and put in shelves, and I've got <coughs> no cooking utensils. Bunch of my electric skillet usually goes in here. Then I got my electric burner. Well. <laughs> electric <clears throat> tuber in there <laughs> yeah and then of course I've got you know extra stuff in here and then this is all storage in here and then of course I got storage under here and I got storage under here so anyway I've got storage everywhere, but when you live in it, yeah, the uh, heater was actually under there. I took it out, put all that storage. I'm just using that. And it was like sub-zero temperatures, and that little electric heater did a good job. That's all it took. And then, of course, uh, <coughs> I got... Oh, all this is all storage up here. Got 
got all kinds of storage up in here. Yep, got a bunch of storage up there. It's all full of stuff. Yep, see? All full of storage up there. <coughs> so anyway, uh, but yeah, I put the new shelf up there, and now I'm thinking about right there where the calendar is. I'm thinking about putting another shelf from here, 10 inches wide, out to about here. And I'll put one of them brackets up here so I can put some light stuff on there. Then I'll take this stuff, put me one of those command hooks under the mirror so I can hang it on there. Still open up the door and get all the storage in there. Yep. So, obviously this is the bathroom. I've just got, you know, let's see if I can move the slight heater out of the way a minute. Okay, uh, there's the riser for the toilet, and then there's the shower head, and the valve that turns it on, and all that stuff, got me a soap rack back there, and I don't know if I can show you this or not, but there's a rail right up here, and that curtain just slides down the rail, and Locks off the door so I don't get any sealed the whole thing. All that. That is a top I keep stored in there for a table. Yep. Kill the spider. Alright. So anyway. Then I got. Yeah, I'm going to show that to you. You probably saw it. but Anyway. Bunch of extra stuff I got hanging on the door. Yep. Yeah, like a brush. Well, on the inside of the door, I got one hanging. You know, uh, brush, you know. So, extra soap, alcohol, uh, deodorant, stuff like that. This stuff don't get wet because... They just pulled over in front of the door. And when I'm traveling, I got a little latch. Right here, I just latch so the door can't come open. And then, uh, and then, that one's got a little latch on it right there, so it can't come open. So, anyway. All right, so I, I did leave the hood in. I blew the light bulb out of it, but it does still work. I've got that on there with all that stuff. If I hit a bump or something, a couple, couple things fall off. Ain't too worried about it. You know, it's all plastic. Pick it up. And of course, I showed you all these I made. Then I got uh, some zip tie things. That are reusable. You wrap around here and wrap it around there. And just velcro it tight. It won't come out. There's command strapped up there. Plus, I also ran a screw in them. I don't know if you can see that. And then I've got under here too. Got them under there. Yep. So anyway, oh chalkboard for leaving notes I got chalk right right there batteries freaking exacto knife flashlights pens papers I got all kinds of stuff so anyway the main gist of it is though I finally got my some counter space by putting that up there that is a lifesaver Got my pizzazz up there and all that. It's about any time I want to use any of it, I can just take it down, use it. Wait till it cools off, put it back. No big deal. Got this for my paper plates. Yep. Pretty nice. 
been using the crap out of those. So anyway, I got those hung up. These have uh, just Walmart bags in them. And I stack them in there so you can use them for garbage when you're camping or whatever. So anyway, uh, got a candle over there. Got me this. <clears throat> Bought me one of these. So that way I can just keep some essentials on it and give her a spin to get to what I want. Yep. So anyway, ouch. Uh, nothing fancy. But, it works for me. So, it seems to be working nicely. But, yeah, my main thing was to show you how much counter space I got back just by putting in that one shelf. And that's pretty nice. I'll put that in tonight. I just showed you the video of doing that, but uh, I was kind of in a hurry trying to get it done. So, anyway... But if you like it, subscribe. Oh, check this out. Uh, let's see. Let's get fancy. Click. There you go. Neon blue. <laughs> there you go. Fancy, fancy. Anyway, I just thought I'd show show it to you. Yeah, it's a clock that runs off batteries. As you can see, my hand's not moving, so the battery's dead. <laughs> but it's got its own power source. Yep, yeah, I drilled the hole, ran it, and nailed it into the inside. It runs across and then down the wall to the plug-in. Down to a power strip down here. See, I got power strip there. I got one there. I got a plug in in that corner behind that lamp. I got one there. I got one here. I got one back there. Got disassembled. Got another one behind that. I got one here. Yeah, I might have. I went nuts with the when I was building it. I wanted to make sure I had plenty of power. Then I did have a power strip down here on this, but I took it off because I didn't really need it. So anyway, if you like it, subscribe. Second Chance Garage out.